In our Tuscaloosa newsroom tonight, police have found the body of a missing Jefferson County woman and charged two men with her murder. The body of 20 year old Willow Watkins was found in a well in advance area over the weekend. CBS 42 news reporter Tim Reed speaking with her family tonight. The Tuscaloosa Violent Crimes Unit arrested two men for the murder of Willow Watkins. Today I spoke with the victim's family who tells me they want justice for her murder. I just want justice for her. I just want justice for her. I just love her so much. <laughs> Jennifer Cox and her entire family are devastated. Cox is Willow Watkins' stepmother. This afternoon, the family spent time together in Bessemer grieving the 20 year old's murder. We are extremely devastated. Willow was the most beautiful, special soul I've ever known in my entire life. Um, I don't know anybody who did not love her and care about her. Investigators got a tip on Sunday and discovered the remains of 20 year old Willow Watkins at a vacant house on Will Walker Lane in Vance in Tuscaloosa County. Her body was found at the bottom of a well on that property. The 20 year old had been missing since June 25th. It, it, it was brutal um, and it showed a distinct uh, um, disregard for the, 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 the sanctity of life. 29 year old Kendall Battles and 20 year old Joseph Nevels were both arrested and charged with murder. Investigators believe the suspects assaulted and killed the victim at another location in Tuscaloosa County, then drove her to Vance to get rid of the body. They took away one of the most precious souls I've ever known in my entire life and I hope they get punished to the full extent of the law. And if there's anybody else out there that has any information on anyone else that was involved, please come forward and help our family. Authorities tell us this investigation is ongoing and more arrests are possible. In Tuscaloosa, Tim Reed, CBS 42 News, local coverage you can count on. Tim, thank you.